-hmm. So it's toasted. Like butter <laughs> toast, right? It's like butter toast. Hey everyone. I know it's been a while since I posted, but here we go. This is a kiln uh, that ran a little hot and right before I ran it I did break one of my advancer kiln shelves so this one had a little tricky puzzle about how to get everything in there with the pieces that I had left from the broken shelf. Um, but other than that I got some pretty new new combos I liked and some some good stuff so thanks for watching. on this one. My favorite color is blue and I love the purple and how the blue and purple and then light blue mixed. Yeah, that was a new combo, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Pretty. I like the blue and then the uh, pink. I like how the red or something turned out, and then I like the yellow a lot. And this is the same combo. Because the kiln ran a little hot, that white turned a little bit more yellow, huh? Mm -hmm. So it's toasted. Like butter <laughs> toast, right? It's like butter toast. Delicious. Okay. Let's see the other one. That one's a good one. I like that one. I like this one too. Yeah, it's very similar to the other one that you really like with the purple and the green. Yeah, but this, this one, one has purple. Yeah, this one I had an extra glaze in the middle there that melted between the two. It's made like a almost like a light purple in between. And I like that one. It's so pretty. This is a French press that I started making. Um, they're very tricky, and the plunger set you can get off of Amazon 
but you have to make sure that the inside cylinder stays completely straight and you gotta kind of work with the shrinkage because if it's too loose it won't work as a french press but if it's too tight people don't really want to buy it because they feel like they would have to like really work at getting that plunger up and down inside the ceramic and they don't want to break it but if you can get it just right wow they sell like crazy so consider it um, maybe i'll make a video dark blue. Mm -hmm. I like the little handle that is purple. Yeah, I like this mug a lot too. I just want to chime in saying that the Dove is a new recipe for this gray. It is beautiful. I love it. It goes with so many different colors. But also the Halo Blue is also a new recipe and it uses a different type of clay. So of EPK, it's a New Zealand Halo site. Uh, I'm sure I'm pronouncing that wrong, but it makes a stunning glaze. I, I love it. So I've been using Dove and that Halo Blue just about with, um, yeah, everything. Everything I've been making lately has been with those two colors. I just love it. I think I've, I've been starting to call that Halo Blue Mama Blue because it's beautiful.
crystals that I get with this OTR Rush from Queen City Clay. I love it. They won't share the recipe, but I hope someday they will because I love it.